In this video, we provide the solution to question number nine from practice exam number three for math 1210. We're asked to evaluate the limit as x approaches infinity of hyperbolic secant of x. There's kind of two ways you could approach this. One is just by remembering the graph of hyperbolic secant. Hyperbolic secant has this bump shape to it. In particular, as x approaches infinity, we see that y will approach zero from above. So that would indicate to us that the correct answer is in fact f. So if you know the graph, you can then use that to help us out here. Another way of approaching that is just to rely on the definitions and identities of these hyperbolic functions. So if we're trying to look for the limit of hyperbolic secant of x, that's the same thing as taking the limit as x approaches infinity of one over cosh, right? Which hyperbolic cosine, we know its formula, which we should know is gonna be two over e to the x plus e to the negative x as x approaches infinity here. So then if we do some arithmetic as x goes to infinity here, we're gonna get two over e to the infinity plus e to the negative infinity, for which e to the infinity will be infinite, e to the negative infinity will be zero, which case you get two over infinity, which that tells us we get zero as well. Again, we're approaching from above, but that extra detail is not necessary here. We get the limit is gonna be zero.